Hi everyone, welcome back to Kids Church Preschool Edition. My name's Miss Kelly and I'm here with my buddy Ollie the Owl. Did you know that I love hiking? Some of you know that. I absolutely love going hiking. I hike all the time and a lot of the places I hike actually get pretty hot. So when I go hiking, I'm prepared. I wear my hiking boots, I have the right kind of clothes on, and I always, always bring something. Do you know what the thing is that I always bring? Can you guess when it's hot out? That's right, I always bring my water bottle. It is so important when I go hiking that I'm prepared because when it gets really, really hot, I could actually get in trouble and get really sick if I don't have enough water. So I always bring that with me. But today, Ollie has a story from the Bible about a woman named Hagar and her son and about how God took care of them. So are you ready to hear it? Okay, take it away, Ollie. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. Okay, this one is for Mrs. Burkholtz. Oh, and this one is for Mr. Jackson. Oh, hi, friends. I'm Justin the Mailman. It's so good to see you. I'm just getting all of these letters ready for delivery. I love when people send cards like this. Having a great trip. Miss you. Love, Gigi and Gramps. It's so great. I love all of the different ways that we have to talk to each other. In fact, today's story is about how we can talk to God. Are you ready to hear it? I said, are you ready to hear it? Great. Let me just put the story mail in the mailbox. So our true story from the Bible begins in a desert. Have you ever been to a desert? Some are sandy and hot, like really, really hot. Let's all pretend we're in a desert. Oh, oh man. It's so hot out here. Look at that sun. It must be 100 degrees. I'm sweating. Are you sweating? Let's fan ourselves. Whew. The desert is hot. Well, in today's story, in a hot desert, there was a mother named Hagar and her son. They look so tired, don't they? And hot. Now tell me, what do people need when they are hot and tired? Let's see if you can guess. Do they need a warm coat, roller skates, or a drink of water? A drink of water, that's right. Hagar and her son needed water, but they were out of water. Hagar didn't know what to do. They had no water to drink and couldn't walk any farther. Hagar's son started crying. And then Hagar started crying too. Everyone, let's cry with them. Boo-hoo, boo-hoo. Okay, we can stop. Great job. They were all alone in the desert and thirsty and hot. They thought no one could hear them crying. Except, tell me, who always hears us? God, that's right, God can always hear us. Just then, an angel spoke to Hagar from above. Everyone say, whoa, whoa. The angel told Hagar to not be afraid, that God heard her son's cries and he was showing her where to find water. God loves us so much, doesn't he? He hears us no matter where we are. No matter where we go, God is with us. And we don't have to worry because God's got it. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who's got it? God's got it. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who's got it? God's got it. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. I'll see you next time. 
Hey, Ollie, thanks for that story. It's good to know that God loves us so much and He knows what's going on in our lives. He knows when we need Him and when we're in trouble and when we're hurting, God's there and He cares about us. Would you like to pray to Him right now? Okay, let's pray. Dear God, thank you for this story to remind us that you love us and that you've got this. Help us remember that you are always with us and we can call out to you at any time. In the name of your son, Jesus, amen. Okay, boys and girls, I think we're ready for some music. Are you ready for a really good song? Okay, let's sing and dance. I'm Cecily and I volunteer at the Lighthouse and we're going to do the memory verse. God is with you wherever you go. Joshua 1.9. One more time. God is with you wherever you go. Joshua 1.9. Hey guys, I'm back and it's Kids Creation Time. My name's Caitlin and what I get to do every week here at Kids Church is I get to share your guys' creations. You guys paint and you do some cool stuff. You guys have even gardened this summer. It's been super awesome and I get to share even more this week. So let's jump right in. First, we have a video from my friend Mikey. Oh wow, what do you have there Mikey? It's the butterfly's coming out. I'm so happy. Oh my goodness. Look at how beautiful are you, butterfly? Wow, what a beautiful transformation. Mikey has been growing caterpillars and then they bloom, kind of, into butterflies. He has released six butterflies so far. These kinds of butterflies are called monarch and I love how colorful their wings are. I also love how excited Mikey is to see the butterfly. I would definitely be that excited too, Mikey, if I saw a butterfly in my own house. Great job, Mikey. 
Next, we have a painting from Aurora. Aurora made these awesome paintings. First of all, I love your flip sequin shirt in this picture. I love flip sequins. Second, I love how many colors you used to do this. You made a butterfly painting and then kind of like a red splatter paint. If you guys have never splatter painted before, it is so much fun and it looks awesome like Aurora's. Great job. Next, we have something from Avin. And what Avin made is she made a bed for her mini Ollie the Owl. I don't know if you guys know this. I just found this out from my friend, Miss Kelly. All owls are nocturnal. So they like to sleep during the day. So when you sleep, you need a bed handmade by Avin for your Ollie the Owl. Avin, this looks awesome and I'm sure Ollie loves it too. Last, we have something from Lila. Lila made this awesome drawing. I think it's her family or it's just people. I love all the bright colors. They are wearing the brightest pink dresses ever and they all look so happy out in the outdoors. Lila, you did a great job. That's all I have this week for Kids Creations, but I'll see you guys next week with some more. Bye guys. Caitlin, thanks so much for those Kids Creations. They were awesome. I can't wait to see what we get next week. Now today I've got some activity sheets for you. You can download these in the link below. And parents, if you're not printing at home, just email me here at the church. I'll be glad to send these to you in the mail. So today we've got our memory verse hop. And um, we did this last month. And honestly, we do this every month because the kids love it so much. And so what you do is you just print out the memory verse. We've got all the words here and it's going to just all these different words it's going to spell out god is with you wherever you go joshua 1 9 and I'll lay them out on the floor and then you hop them out as you say each word so have fun hopping out your memory verse and i will see you next week here on kids church preschool